Get set. View. Encounter at L5 for the Atari 2600. Developed and published by Data Age, it was released for the video computer system in 1982. Up to two players take control of an antimatter launcher and have to protect the L5 colony from the attacking Megalite warriors so you can rack up the points. You control your antimatter launcher by moving it with the rotator dial on the paddle controller and the button is used to shoot, but you can also hold the button down and use the dial to rotate the direction of where you are firing. The difficulty switches together can determine how fast the enemies can approach and attack. As said before, the object is to rid the megalite threat that you're encountering at the L5 colony. You have 9 warrior ships appearing at all times, and the farther behind the ship is, the more points it's worth, so I guess the basic strategy would be to get as much of the front cleared so you can get more points from the lingering ships. From time to time you'll hear a warning alarm signifying the presence of a death ship. It's worth the most and also the most deadly, so it'll be in your best interest to try and angle your shot in order to destroy him. While on the subject of the angle, when you let go of the button if you've been holding on to it for an extended period, you'll briefly disappear and reappear under the cursor above. Think of it as a quick warp that could get you out of a sticky situation or right into another one. If you get hit by any enemy fire, you'll lose a life, lose all your lives, the game is over, and the colony will be lost, but there are 26 different game variations to try out. Though the manual doesn't specify the differences, and apparently you'll go to the next once you hit an 800 point mark, though I couldn't tell the difference anyway. Overall, this is an alright Atari title. Too simple for my blood and could have been better if there were weight breaks in between. And stop! Thanks for watching guys, be sure to like, share, and comment on the video, and if you want to see more quick views, go ahead and hit that subscribe button. This is Brian the Blue, and I'll see you next time.